14 years in the making, the project was something to relish and cherish for the thirsty communities of Guiana and surrounding areas. Over 50 villages are expected to benefit from the project, but delays caused by various factors such as alleged corruption, technical deficiencies and discontent by traditional authorities have been the prime challenges. Residents say the project completion date has been postponed three times this year. I cannot say I'm excited because the service delivery that our people are receiving is not proper. Uh, but we are hoping that, that when the president visits, we'll outline our issues as, as the people of Guiani. We'll tell, we'll tell him whatever it is that is happening, in particular in terms of the, 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 the project that is happening. Uh, remember, this project has been going on for a very long time. It's been 14 years now. The sprawling Nandoni Dam is the major source of water supply for the Guiani Water Project. It's believed the project is over 80 percent complete, but disgruntled communities continue to languish in unquenched thirst. The issue of villages around Guiani is still a concern because uh, we don't have uh, uh, water uh, since we promised that uh, around September the 30th will be having running water. And then they were, the date was changed again to be the November the 30th. There's still no running water. It seems as uh, this issue of water here in Guiana, it will be a song. The Office of Water Affairs and Sanitation Minister Senzo Kunu has confirmed the minister will embark on an oversight visit on Sunday. Rutan Bobodi for SABC News in Guiana.